Hello and welcome to Skill Techathon. This is SQL interview questions and answer series. Today we are going to look into one of the interview questions where we have been given an input table month, category and amount. And we need to convert this table into month, clothing and electronics. So what we are doing is we are transforming the rows into columns. So in this category table we have rows electronics clothing so the category type is electronics and clothing all types and we have month wise sale data now we need to convert this rows electronics and clothing into columns clothing electronics and month as well then we need to find out the month wise what was the amount or what was the sales so in january in clothing it's 1200 so it's 1200 here. Then in February, clothing is 1300. So we got 1300. So we have to convert this rows into columns. Let's go to SQL and look how we can do it. Okay. I've already written the query to create the table. So let me run this query. I'm creating a sales data table. Let me insert the values as well. Now let's check our table. Let me drag this up a little. So we have month, category and amount. So in month we have January twice, February twice, March, then April same twice. Then category we have electronics and clothing and amounts we have 1500, 1200, 1800 like that. Now we need to transform these rows into columns. So what we are going to do is we are going to use cross tab. So I'm using PostgreSQL. That's why I'm using cross tab. Otherwise in MS SQL server, you can use pivot as well. So we use cross tab function to pivot the data. The cross tab function requires a query that returns three columns, row identifier, category, and value. In our case, month will be the row identifier, category will be used to pivot, and amount will be the value. Now let's write the query. So select, we want to select everything. From now we need to write the keyword cross tab. Now inside cross tab, our identifier, row, row identifier is month, right? So we are going to write select month, comma. Now we want to pivot it by category. So category, comma, and the value is amount. From cells underscore data table. Now we want to order by one comma two. Order by one comma two is, one is order by the first column, then order by the second column. Now, as, city let's give it as a name as city inside city we'll write what we want month in hair care then clothing we want in numeric comma then electronics that too we want in numeric okay now let's run this query Okay, we are getting an error. So it's because we need to use double quotes here. So let me use double quotes. Now let's run this. So now we got the output, which was required from us. So we got month, clothing and electronics. Month, we got April, February, January, March. In clothing, we are getting 1400, 1300, 1200, 1100. In electronics, 17. 18, 15, 1600. Here we used as CT, right? It's an alias actually. So we are specifying the output columns of the pivot table here. The month, clothing and electronics. See month, clothing and electronics. So we are specifying the output columns. So the month is in where care because it's a string value, right? So clothing and electronics and numeric as these are numeric values. 
So this is how using cross step we can pivot our data in PostgreSQL. If you are using MS SQL Server, you can use pivot. I hope it's clear. Thank you. We'll see you in the next video.